Patient Safety First is a partnership among five different entities. One is, of course, the National Health Foundation. The other is Anthem Blue Cross, who is the funder of the initiative. And the other are the three regional hospital associations across the state. That includes the Hospital Association of Southern California, the Hospital Council of Northern and Central California, and the Hospital Association of San Diego and Imperial Counties. A hospital-acquired infection is one that occurs after a patient has been hospitalized. Typically an infection that occurs as a result of a procedure. Patient Safety First is a peer-to-peer -peer learning collaborative that accelerates the adoption of best practices and strategies for improvement within hospital walls. Peer-to-peer -peer model of learning is primarily one of each one teach one, if you will. And in terms of patient safety first, the focus is, is on the medical community. The peer-to-peer -peer learning actually occurs during regional meetings where hospitals send teams of two to three clinicians to day-long learning sessions where they can learn from expert speakers. They also learn from each other, from different hospitals. It was the ability to say, we put this practice into place. Has anybody else put that into place? Are they finding it helpful? And I think more than anything else, it gave us a way to define what success looks like. We have been able to take our elective delivery rate from, we started around 12% um, when this collaborative started, and we've been at zero for the past year. Patient Safety First has made significant improvements in reducing hospital-acquired infections, reducing rates of sepsis mortality, and improving perinatal care. The notion of collaboration uh, within a hospital is extremely important. You really improve the benefit on a much larger scale. One of the things that I've learned is that bringing the hospital together as a team is the most important thing in changing the culture. I know where we've started, I know where we are now, and I realize where we need to go to reach all of our goals that, that we have set for ourselves as a hospital. We're no longer treating as many complications. So that's less expensive, better care for the patients. There's an absolute alignment between the patient safety first goals and objectives and outcomes and healthcare reform. Better care costs less, not more. The Patient Safety First program, through a series of peer-to-peer um, -peer learning networks and through sharing of best practices, has resulted in some phenomenal results that we're really, really proud of. We have um, not only saved a tremendous amount of money, but more importantly, and the thing that I'm most proud of, is that this program has resulted in lives that have been saved. This program could really help improve care across the country because as a partnership between health plans and providers, it can be replicated in every state. Patient Safety First has really embraced the all teach, all learn philosophy, meaning everybody can learn from each other and what they've done and everybody is able to teach each other um, based on their own experiences in quality improvement efforts. Patient safety is really more than just implementing best practices. It's about transforming the culture of organizations. When families turn to their local community hospital, they expect the highest quality and patient safety that's possible. These results translate to over 3,500 people returning to their families and not dying in the hospital and savings of over $63 million.